anti-drug group DARE has once more proven its ineptitude. The organization that posted a satirical news article as fact on their website earlier this year has now accidentally published an article supporting cannabis legalization. On Monday, DARE reposted a letter to the editor of the Columbus Dispatch titled Purchasing Marijuana Puts Kids at Risk. But if the people at DARE bothered to read past the headline, they would know that the letter clearly calls for legalizing cannabis. Evidently, they didn't even make it to the byline, as the article's author is Carlos McDermott, a former deputy sheriff who now works with LEAP, or Law Enforcement Against Prohibition. In the letter, McDermott argues that cannabis prohibition makes the plant more accessible to children. Quote, I know from enforcing senseless marijuana laws that children are only being put in more danger when marijuana is kept illegal. The goal of prohibiting marijuana was to eradicate its use, but in reality, the drug has become infinitely harder for law enforcement to control. She added that while cannabis can be harmful to children, anyone who suggests we outlaw everything dangerous to children would also have to ban stairs, Tylenol, bleach, forks and outlet socks, and definitely alcohol. The answer isn't prohibition and incarceration. The answer is regulation and education. After Dare posted the letter, New York Magazine called the organization's apparent change in ideology a breakthrough. Today, however, the article was removed from Dare's website, and a spokesperson clarified that they do not support cannabis legalization.